Golly guys, I don't know if I'm gonna get a team builder video up this week. Um, I figured the battle is much more important. So, I'm doing it first. Um, <coughs> should I have time, I will upload these like one after the other. We'll see. Uh, if I don't have time, you can message me on social media, at YoFizYT. Bam. And then I'll tell you. You can be like, dude, why did you bring Rhyperior? I'll be like, dude, cause I don't know, he's cool looking, man. He's got a drill and a horn. Uh, you know, stuff like that. So, let's, let's get, let's get into the match. Okay. So, I'm gonna lead off with my boy, um... Oh, he's leading off with, uh, Mega Diancy. I'm leading off with my boy, a Brother Nero. Brother Nero. I assume he's going to, uh, you know, protect Mega up. Um, trying to bounce back these rocks. I go right into Florgus. Um, I notice it can set up on a few things on his team. I'm running Calm Mind this week. Uh, but he does have Steelix, and the goal is to get Steelix out of the way before I start calm minding on stuff, because due to mathematics and calculators, uh, I found out that Florigus can straight up just calm mind on uh, Magneton, even if, if even if he's locked in the flash cannon with Scarf or whatever. Feels good. Oh, this is a risky play. Bam! I switched in the Volcanion um, on his rocks. I figured he'd either go for like a heavy slam or something. I go for Volcanion. Um, his sturdy still broken, so now I get a free hit. I know that he's gonna go into Politoed and then get fire blasted. Um, the other thing is I wanted to mention about Magneton is it's a smart bring because he must have watched my video last week and saw how well I handled not fully evolved electric types. And so he was like, Yeah, that's his weakness. NFE electric types. Doesn't matter how bad they are, I just can't handle them. I don't know. It's I knew he was going to Toxic here, um, so I brought in the Sizer. It seems like a smart play. Um, it's really the only thing he can do to Volcanion with a Politoed, so, you know, bring in Sizer. Um, real, recognize real. Uh, I'm going to double switch out into, um, into my boy right here, just in case he went for Scald. Um, he didn't, so that's cool, though. Um, go for a Volt Switch, get a huge time crit on the stupid, stupid Ghost. Um, feels pretty good going to Yow because I figure um, he probably wisps here, um, but he actually sets up toxic spikes, which is scary. Um, he goes back into Politoed, and I'm like, dude, I'm gonna go click overheat this time. Specs overheat, resisted. <sighs> feels pretty good. Um, I know that's not gonna do a KO from here, but. You know, taking a huge chunk out of Politoed like that feels amazing. Um, I'm gonna switch right out, go into Sizer, um, should he do anything uh, to me. I do have a Cleric uh, this week in um, Florida, so if he does burn me, I can fix it. Um, he double switches into Mega Diancy, which is pretty awesome. I really want to click the button. Um, to kill it, but I go, okay, Chimp's not that real. <laughs> um, so I go for Defog, because I know he's going to switch out. Um, get rid of the rocks, get rid of the spikes. Feels pretty good, man. Um, and now he's got Tornadoes in against me. I know the moves that thing gets, so I switch out. I go into Brother Nero. Um, as he goes for U-Turn. It feels pretty good, man. I can't, I can't lie there. Brother Nero, he's in. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it with Brother Nero. Um, he goes in Politoed, which is great. I have Thunder Punch, and I do have a problem with clicking the damage button, so this week, I, I try to play it a little bit differently than I normally would have. Um, normally I would have gone for Thunder Punch, um, but I went for Stealth Rocks, and he Magic bounces them back, which is alright. I mean, what are you gonna do? Um, should I gone for Thunder Punch, like I do here, I think, it actually does 40% of this thing. So I could have theoretically, I might have had a shot at dealing with this thing should I Thunder Punched it the turn before. Because uh, Thunder Punch, Thunder Punch, then Shadow Sneak uh, might actually get me the KO. It actually probably, it probably gets me a little short. Uh, so Moonblast um, in the Florigus, um, it's max defense, max HP. 
Um, it does way more than I would like it to. I'm like, Florigus, dude. Dude, your special defense, it's like super duper high. Um, but then I was like, mm, but, but Mega Diancy, your special attack is super duper higher. So what are you going to do? I heal on the turn there. Um, he goes for knockoff. And losing leftovers, honestly, isn't the worst thing here. Um, and it allows me to call mind. Um, and the, that was if he was going to stay in against with Diancy, because he totally could have. It would have been a legitimate like go about it. Um, he's going to U-turn here, and I believe I just go straight for the attack. Um, and Because I, I know, I know Steelix is coming in. Steelix, you're here, you're there. You're freaking everywhere that I don't want you to be. So hit him with the, the neutral Moonblast. I drop his special attack, which is super important against a Steelix. Super duper incredibly important. Keep it, keep, keep that in mind for later. I bring in brother Nero, um, because I was like, all right, I gotta stack something. Probably it's probably gonna be Nero. Um, he actually goes for toxic, and I actually have one berry. So mm, 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 I'm healed, and I'm like, hey, I can click rocks again if I wanted to, um, or I can go for a punch or something. I decided to go for the rocks, um, and as he goes into uh, tornadoes, which is. Uh, an interesting play by him. It was kind of risky. <laughs> he's risking a stab thunder punch. I mean, he saw it. So, I go for the shadow sneak to get some damage on it. I intended to sack this thing anyway, so I got rocks up and I got the shadow sneak off. So, you know, not too shady. Um, he went for knockoff, killed me, whatever. Now, I go in Rhyperior, man. Rhyperior is sub rock polish. Dual stab. He knocks off my life orb, which sucks. I set up a sub though, because I was like, alright, that's the worst he can do. No! He has Icy Wind! What is this? What is this? So he's got U-turn, knock off Icy Wind? What the hell is this? It's actually a pretty good moveset against my team, but I did not I did not expect it. I go for Rock Blast here, because I need to, need to kill this thing. It's faster um, than me after Rock Polish, so I didn't bother here. Now, he goes into uh, Diancy and I'm like, okay, well, I think Moonblast probably takes care of me pretty good. If he has Earth Power, that takes care of me pretty good. So I'll go into uh, Florigus again, takes Rock's damage, and a Moonblast here. And Moonblast again, I'm like, ah. So I, I, I switch out again, I go into Sizer, I'm like, look, if he has HP Fire, he's not this real. Um, so, but he has Diamond Storm, this little... Oh, chimp act! Got diamond storm. Does not feel good. So again, um, I don't click the button, which I'm very proud of, honestly. Very proud of, proud of not picking a uh, bullet punch there. A U-turn out. Um, as much as my soul <laughs> wanted to bullet punch, I did not do it. Um, chimp act also has rocky helmet, which made me incredibly angry because it's like well now size is death water because I can't defog anymore and there's rocks on the field and then we'll die rocks so I set up another sub here in case he goes for um, the willow or setting up spikes or like the pain split um, he didn't he just goes for shadow ball which is a solid play I'm gonna have to earthquake I'll take care of him you're done um, anything left on his team it doesn't really want to deal with right here but Diane sees faster, <laughs> so um, I switch into Sizer, um, so it gets it dies to rocks. Um, aha! You can't have this kill, Diancy. Yeah, Dingle. You little Dingle Jingle. Now I go into um, the Machine Gun, Carl Anderson, um, and I'm like, Yo, Focus Blast hits literally everything on this team and it has a chance at hitting everything super hard so I click it he went for protect I click it again because I have a 70% chance of basically winning here and I do not um, at this point he had Diancy and Steelix and Politoed and Magneton and really Diancy was the only thing standing in my way um, I go for earth power here and he goes for magnet rise um why 
I'm not positive. It must have been in case like Diamond Storm Mist or something. Um, so I just I switch and maybe I can play Z Mind Games. Maybe he will think I'm Z Scarf, but um, obviously not because he was faster on that mine, that Magnet Rise. Um, Elgin's not gonna be able to take a hit. No one can take a hit. He just wins with Diancy now. Um, that Focus Blast, man. I'll tell you what. Um, it was 100% the correct play. It was basically the only play. I mean, I could have gone for Thunderbolt, but then he has Steel It, so. Focus Blast, 100% correct play. 70% chance to continue this match. Um, I think, after I got rid of Diancy, that the game was mine. But, you know, that's the only hero there. Um, because that didn't happen. 30% chance. I missed. Look, I know people are afraid of Focus Blast. Can't be afraid of Focus Blast. I was full on ready to click Focus Blast four times in a row and hit them all. And I was like, got it. It's fine. I got it. So, whatever. Um, so, I want to say good game to Chip. Um, that Tornado set was really cool. Um, I don't know. I guess it was. It worked. So I guess it was pretty cool. Um, Dancy was pretty cool too. Um, I probably should have went. Okay, what? Hmm. I. You know what? There's a couple of things that I wish I could have taken back. Um. Really? Okay. The only thing was would have been the U-turn into the Rocky Helmet. Ghost Boy. If I had Roosted, then I would have more HP. And then, that. So, hindsight being 2020, that would have been the play. However, I don't think U-Turn was incorrect. Um, U-Turn was... Okay, going for Roost instead of U-Turn on that particular turn now looks correct, but that's result-based thinking. I think U-turn 100% of the time is the correct play there. You get momentum, you can get your switch in. So, I don't mind this game at all. I feel confident in myself, my abilities, even though the scoreboard will say, Yo Fizz, you lost 4-0 to Chimp. That does not feel good. But, I know the deal. We know. You and I, we see eye to eye. Um, it was a good game, though, and should he finally, finally drop that diss track, I will be ready to vomit Venom and Spitfire. But I do have to say one thing. I have now lost two weeks in a row, and this is new to me. I don't like this. I don't like it one bit. And the fact of the matter is, my schedule for the rest of the season is not easy. It's Tup, Sam, Miguel. We are 5-4. and four. We're looking for a wild card at this point. I think Chimp, unless he goes on a massive losing streak, has the division. So... I need to take these three games, and I can't lose again. So, Top, I see you. We're cut from the same cloth, part of the same group. But this week, this week I'm on my own. This week, I will be the sole survivor of your final deletion. I can't lose. And I won't lose. It's gonna be a wrap for you.